Hey guys, so today I want to make a quick little gaming comparison here with my Samsung Galaxy Note 3 and my iPhone 5S and we'll be taking a look at I think four different uh, various games here and we'll be playing them and checking them out a little bit and see how the performance is here on Android versus the iPhone 5 with the latest version of iOS here so uh, let's, let's go, let's, let's do this so you can see here that this one is the 5S down here with that little fingerprint or touch ID sensor. So let's just start off here by closing everything in the background. And then let's just go in here to the first game, which could be GTA War City, and then maybe Asphalt 8, FIFA 14, and Modern Combat 4. So. I like the same loading time here. Let's see here. So of course it's not a new GTA game, but it's the latest that I do have a well ball right here. So <clears throat> let's just, um, have a look at it. So. Okay, so start off here with the note phone. So this one has of course 2.3 GHz quad core so better specs on the paper compared to the iPhone 5S. Uh, Snapdragon 800 is also a big step up there from the, the Galaxy S4. I definitely do feel that the performance probably here is better because Snapdragon 600, the performance wasn't really all that great in this game. You feel some kind of weird vibration here happening sometimes. But performance is okay. Whoa. And of course the amazing thing here is that this display is, is so big. But I'm not sure why I'm feeling these weird vibrations here in the game. You can also see the map here and all that jazz. Let's try it now on the iPhone. So what I immediately can feel here on the iPhone is that the performance is even a little bit more smooth than what you do get on Android. But then, of course, you have to think about that you get this smaller display, only 4 inch, compared to the Note 3 is 5.7 inch, which is even bigger than the Note 2. But if you're happy with this size, then why not go with it? Then also feel that you can get a little bit better performance here. Could be worth it if you like the display size and you just want to have the best possible frame rate then this iPhone here definitely is a go whoa do I really need to unlock this? I probably have to Let's take a look at another game just go with Asphalt 8 Great stuff. Let's 
start up here again uh, on the uh, the note phone Once again, that thing is, the big display is really, really making a difference. But once again, in, in also in this game, I can feel that the performance probably will be a little bit better here on the iPhone. I'm not saying that lagging here it's Android, but it's just something with that, that you can feel that it's a little bit more optimized there in the iPhone experience. And um, right now I'm just talking about the frame rate, but if you talk about the display size, I mean, wow. The Note phone is really, really a good go. But I'm also a guy that looking for the best possible performance. And uh, right now here, I mean, we do have another boy for that. That is probably the iPhone. Apple has built a very, very magical ecosystem that just works. But I would say probably that I would prefer a big display any time of the year. Kind of feels like the performance here is like 35 FPS, maybe stable, but on the iPhone. It probably feels like 60 FPS stable, and that's, that's kind of you feel the difference. And I don't care if you have like a if you have if, if the Note 3 has to render more pixels or any shit like that. I mean, the performance is still that's the thing I'm looking for. And Apple is a little bit lucky there that they haven't made a bigger display, so they can still have this awesome performance and that they still have pretty low resolution on their display but it doesn't really matter when the display is small so definitely better performance here on the iPhone whoa I'm going down <laughs> oh my god I wonder if Android ever will feel as good in games uh, compared to an iPhone that's a good question Probably someday. So let's take a look at another game now. Let's have a look here at. Uh, let's take a look at uh, Modern Combat 4. Kind of feels like when I'm clicking on stuff that's a little bit better also on the iPhone. That it reacts a little bit quicker. This one on the Note phone, it kind of like blacks out the display, or nothing seems to be happening the first milliseconds, and then everything's happening. Don't get me wrong, though. That overall, I would easily probably be a guy that would pick the Note phone.
because I'm a big lover of big fat screens. Okay, so let's check out this game though. This game is a little bit interesting. I think it's a little bit closer to the iPhone experience here. Or it definitely feels like the iPhone experience here in this game. Uh, this game really, really feels optimized for Android. I, c I can't really tell the difference between this and the iPhone. So I would actually say that this is the performance that you're looking for. If you are a Modern Combat, modern combat 4 fan, you're definitely going to enjoy this. And the other games were from GTA, that was from Rockstar, and that other game was from... Yeah, that was also from Gameloft, but it didn't have the same kind of feel as this game has. Maybe it is because it's a little bit slower here, you don't move as quick. But it feels like an iPhone, I mean, the, the experience is amazing. And look, I know a lot of people are gonna hate on that and be like, Oh, what the fuck are you talking about? Well, I'm just being... I'm just trying to be honest here. <laughs> uh, But yeah, the performance is so amazing in this game. It feels so good. Wow. Wow, I died. I suck. I suck hard. Okay, maybe the iPhone still has a little bit higher performance, but it really is a small difference. And of course, this game, you definitely want that bigger display, I mean, oh my god. But then I like holding the iPhone here also when it is a small display because it's like a little bit more compact. So I'm giving you mixed opinions and views here. It really feels crystal clear, crystal clear here in the performance. I mean, wow. It is good. Feels like I know what the fuck I'm doing. That's a nice feeling. Whoa, bro. So, just quickly look here at this game. I'll still call, I'll, I'll call the note a winner in that game because of the big display and also the performance that was actually really, really close to the iPhone. And then we do have another game here, it was going to be the new FIFA game, FIFA 14. EA this is actually an awesome game, I bought it for my Xbox 360, the new FIFA 14. And also NHL 14, I mean, that's amazing. Wow, that's, that's a fun game. I'm just gonna go with the normal team here, the default. I'm not gonna use the new touch controls, but they do have some awesome new touch controls in the game that you can try to take advantage of. I mean, they are amazing. They are so good. Oh my God, they're so good. They're so super good. Oh my God, they're super good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I also do believe this is going to be a game that I'm going to pick the Note phone clearly as a winner because this is a slow game. Uh, you won't probably not feel a difference in terms of the performance. Whoa. Uh, you're probably gonna, not going to see a major performance difference here because this is a slow game. This is in... In... Uh, in Modern Combat. But amazing game, amazing graphics, amazing performance. 
Whoa. You should ever check out the new touch controls. I haven't done it and at the moment. I haven't picked time to learn it. You can also see that this place also is very, very different here in terms of quality. I know it kind of suck right now when I'm playing, but... You don't get any lag spikes or anything, of course, in games like this, that's the amazing part. Ouch. That sucks. It's right now on the iPhone. And we have the rumors now that the new iPhone next year is going to have a super big display. I mean like a 4.8 inch display. Oh, the performance is so good here. It's so good! I don't know why, but it's super good. Super good, I did goal. Oh my god. But still, holding this device in my hand, wow, the performance. Wow, what are you doing? No! No, what are you doing? Oh my god. They almost scored. That would suck hard. Oh, 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 oh. oh yeah! Wow, that's nice. Oh, oh, oh my god. What? Wow, I love this game. It's so easy. Even though, okay, I'm, I know, I'm, I'm playing on. I'm not playing a super hard here, but. Fun game, so some quick gaming here, gaming comparison, I mean both are very very high end phones, but uh, in those two last games I would say the Note 3 and in those two first games I would easily say the iPhone 5, so no, the iPhone 5S. Sometimes I say the iPhone 5, sorry, <coughs> that's just because I made like 10,000 videos on the iPhone 5 and the 5S I've only been having, for it, uh, having it for around a week, so don't hate, he's gonna hate though, peace out.